hi guys and welcome back to my channel hope you are doing well and there's things to be said first guys so thanks for watching liking sharing commenting and also for subscribe my channel thanks for you all i'm, I'm grateful I, i'm happy for you all guys for following me <laughs> so subscribe my channel and like these videos the thing and let's get in the video tonight so tonight i'm gonna talk about some heartbroken people when i'm heartbroken people i mean the youngsters to you know, and the yeah nowadays the youngsters they fell in love they go and finding our relationship and they go out find our partner you know so on and so forth and they end up in a misery they end up in hating their life and they end up you know saying my uh, i hate my life my life is not worth it i i'm not worth it man i'm born a failure you know so on and so forth they keep on telling and finally they end up putting god you know you know they say they blame the god they won't say they blame the god they blame they blame the god for doing some wrong they did something bad and they blame the god you know why they do this is because you know i'm gonna say you something and then i'm gonna uh, uh, i'm gonna answer some questions okay to make you to come out of it whether you, if you are in the trouble that you are in by loving someone and hurting yourself then you must be listening to this you must have listened to this so say I'm gonna say this then uh, when you are first loving someone he or he, he or she blows uh, says my be there so you know when you are loving someone when you are loving him or her you know you call the God where, where you worship you know you go you may be going to church temple or mosque you know wherever you God you pray so <clears throat> you God you God your God and you ask a god please make her or him you know to love me back so the god is gonna make you so god when he gives you that's a blessing you say oh man he honored me he killed me he is like um uh, maybe i'm the best best of his yeah you know so on and so forth you think and you say the god is blessing god is good you know but comes to your mind you say that and you're having this happy life with her or him you know you're talking together and you're having fun and all of it you know in the mobile phone or in the social media wherever the love is going through so you are like you're happy you are having leading your happy life now so when problem comes to the first thing that kicks out so you you like man i'm done god is no more man he hates me he has cursed me and so on and so forth comes to your mind so the third thing when that girl or boy leaves you behind saying that i won't come back to your life ever again then you are like god you say that why did this happen to me why did god didn't do i mean why didn't god do me another thing if he knows this this is gonna be going from me and he knows that i'm gonna be depressed and i'm gonna be having these crying thoughts you know bad thoughts and everything if i if he knew that then why did he do that to me you know that's a question you ask yourself right so that's the that's a question i'm gonna answer right <clears throat> so the first thing is the first thing is guys the god gives you because he promised us that he's gonna give us so when you ask him is not gonna back down it's not gonna say no he's gonna give it to you so it's it's a promise is fulfilling so his, his promise being fulfilled and you are gonna ask now then if she's gonna make a problem and she's gonna just leave me like that then why did he give it me he must have not given it me you know he must have given something else without this girl this without this guy or without this thing or without this money i'm having right now so everything so the thing is boy uh, this thing is is giving you because to test you you know he blessing you and he knows it's gonna be you know that guy or that girl is gonna leave you behind like just like that in a sec so he wants to test test you at the right time he want to test you because there's gonna be tests and trials in your lives 
but we are living it so it's gonna give you you wanna bless you with that thing and you wanna test you with that thing whether you are gonna go to him when a problem comes or you're gonna back down and you're gonna go find your friends i mean many of us nowadays know when a problem comes and pops our mind first thing we do is run to our friends and asking for help and everything but that doesn't work out like that if you go with god if you're going to ask god something that you want then why can't you ask his help why can't you have his help he's the one who can help you out of it not your friends not anyone else but only him so you must start to go to him if even if you're gone to him and his help didn't come out then you have to consider that god knows everything he knows everything about the future and he's not gonna mislead you he's gonna guide you so anything he does is for good guys anything he does is for good so it's gonna be a good in it you need to know it it's gonna be something good in it without it god will not do that to you so that's it that's that's the thing the third thing if if he, if he leaves you behind you have to put it that god knows everything than me you know than me than you anyone out there bro he knows everybody so the thing another thing i want to share to you guys is that uh i want to say this guys that god loves you god loves us more than he more than our mother loves us more than our mother that is 100 times more love than our mother has to us okay so that's not that's not a small thing guys that's a big big thing now hundred times than our mother does you know he's loving us more than that then how can we say that he's gonna put us down that he's not loving us anymore like he's gonna put you down he will never put you down he will only guide you to the right path so that's that's god's power you know he is using everything to help you out of it you know you never know what's gonna happen in the future you, we never know what's gonna happen in the future we, we never we never gonna like say i'm gonna do that tomorrow because we never know okay you you're gonna be alive tomorrow or not because you know that stuff's like that so <laughs> it's going on so what i want to do what i want to tell you guys is you have to trust god you have to faith in the god that he would never let you down okay he would never let you down and the second thing is you want to put your, all your efforts in it you you have to work hard man your life has better your life will be better if he or she is not with you and that's you have to thank god for that whatever it is going through your life it's a for a reason man and if you stand up for God, then you are the one who have, tra who have touched the light of the God. I mean, you are the one. That's God. You, you're going to be in the eyes of the God. Very, very great man. Because, you know, he created you for a purpose. And that's to pray and, you know, ask his forgiveness. So you need to ask his forgiveness. If you're going through the pain that you are in right now, then you must be turning back to the god because without god we can't live because without god we will not be having what we have today so thank god for that and mostly in the social medias nowadays you know many people they think that sharing their sharing their problems in the social media will help them to get through no man it's the wrong thing but what i want to say is don't just stop them to don't don't do this sis don't do this brother but boy what you doing man it's not good to share your you know sadness and happiness in the social media thing but i want to say that is when you say something well you know they've been saving saying that i hate my life my heart is broken or something the social media they share so when you see that don't ask why okay don't ask why what happened you know <clears throat> We do that because we think uh, we 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 know we know that we we gonna ask that why why are you doing this why are you doing the bad brother why are you in this you know why are you doing this you you know that he's never gonna answer you back 
because you know what you're forcefully pushing someone to think about their past when you do that they're gonna think about the past but they're not gonna answer you back so what i'm gonna tell you here is a huge message man so here we go so when you see a message like that when when you see something like that in the social media then what you have to do is what you have to do is boys you have to just go in and say some kind words like you know what if that person has left you man leave it because god you know you if you put the word god in it in your message if you put the god in your message then they're gonna have a relief in their heart man that's what you have to give not the pain you know what i want to tell you something more important too so let me give you a simple message man yesterday is history tomorrow is mystery and present is a gift from god that's why it's called present so right now we are the right now i'm sorry right now is a gift from god that's why it's called the present so this to be honest man this this message just i share right now is not my own thought you might have heard in the movie or something and i and i want to share with here because i want to tell you that guys here because I want to give a message that's all that's all that's why I did that that's why I just said that man so I think this would be helpful maybe you know I want to beg you for that I mean not to ask a why or what what happened question in someone's you know someone's heartbroken status you know what they have put in you have to just give them a kind advice you know God will not put you down if anything happened is for everything happens for a reason and pray pray to God and thank him for what he have done because he knows the future we don't know the future that's it man that's what I want to say today and thanks for watching guys thanks for liking and subscribing and if you like this video if you like this video put your thumbs up and subscribe my channel that's it and don't forget to hit the bell icon because you will never ever miss out any videos from my channel ever again so i think until next time peace